Hi, my name's Bob Lindy. I'm an acupuncture physician and registered herbalist. Today I'm going to talk to you about medicinal plant and herbal remedies. Of course, there are literally tens of thousands of different types of plants and herbs that are utilized for medicine throughout the world. In the Chinese herbal pharmacy alone, there's over 10,000 plants that are regularly used in the pharmacy. And actually, the Chinese actually stretch the definition of what an herb is quite a bit. We actually can use anything from animal parts to rocks to shells. We even use flying squirrel feces and certain bugs and even geckos and snakes. So the idea of an herb can be very, very diverse depending on the particular cultural context that it's utilized in. But you'll find herbal traditions in Central and South America, throughout North America, and all the indigenous people all have their own unique herbs that they use. Also in Europe, India, and throughout Africa, there's just hundreds and hundreds of herbs that are being utilized. And ultimately, each system has their own tradition on how they're combined and prescribed and for what unique ailments, both spiritual and physical, that people may be dealing with. So it's important that you find a local herbalist in order to prescribe the best group of herbs and plants that can be most helpful for your particular disorder. And ultimately, it can come in many different forms, tinctures, pills, and ultimately the favorite of all herbalists, and that's a cup of tea. So remember, get your herbs together that are most effective for you as they're prescribed by a local herbalist, put them in your French press, and let them steep and enjoy a good cup of tea. This is Bob Lindy talking to you about plants and herbs that are medicinal around the world. So please enjoy your herbs.